channel welcome back to a brand new video welcome to september the autumn season is fast approaching and as soon as it hits september here on youtube i just feel like autumn content just blows up everybody seems to love it as much as i do which is so exciting so today i thought i would start off september with a bit of an autumn capsule wardrobe i've got 15 pieces key pieces with some new in bits as well. I have kept this brand specific to Topshop, but the idea behind a capsule wardrobe is that it's key pieces that you may already have in your wardrobe from other brands, but I will leave links to everything below should you wish to shop any of these exact items yourself. And before I jump into showing you my 15 key autumn essential capsule pieces in my wardrobe this year, I firstly want to thank ShopTagger for very kindly sponsoring today's video. If you're new to my channel, then you won't have heard me talk about ShopTagger before. However, it is something that I have preached to you guys because it is so good it's free to download essentially what it is is it's an online platform that you can download via your desktop or app and use in order to shop savvy so if you like a bargain if you like to save money like i do then it is the perfect platform for you i personally like to use it on my desktop because i always do my online shopping on my laptop so you go to google chrome download the browser button completely free of charge and then head to one of the many thousands of retailers that shop tagger work with and you simply shop as you normally would and then if you come across any items that are out of stock in your size or if you are wanting to wait for them to reduce in price then shop tagger allows you to save that particular item and to be notified when it a comes back in stock in your size or b is reduced in price you can save your items to different wish lists and i personally like to have different ones for like fashion beauty homeware and I also love, dare I say it, for Christmas gift ideas or birthdays, I suppose. I have a little gift wish list for family and friends and they send me either an email or push notification as soon as that item is reduced in price. What's more, they also have a coupon code feature. So as and when you are at checkout, they automatically scan the internet to see if there are any discount codes for you to save further money off your shop. And they have now introduced a new cashback feature, which is music to my ears. Thank you to ShopTagger for very kindly sponsoring today's video. And without further ado, let's get into my 15 autumn capsule wardrobe essentials. So I'm actually gonna start with a pair of shoes. These are a absolute go-to for me during autumn. It is, of course, a chunky white trainer. Now, I know there are lots of designer options, but if you are looking for a more budget alternative, Primark do a great selection. In fact, one of my favorite pairs of chunky trainers is from Primark, and I found them in the sale at just five pounds. Mega bargain. However, I have also picked up this sort of mid-range price point chunky trainer from Topshop. Up. these were in the sale so hopefully they should still have some in stock they were reduced down to 25 pounds and 60 pence and i love the fact that they are a good solid chunky white trainer but they also have a bit of beige and natural colors running through here which just ties really nicely into some of the natural tones that i have throughout my autumn wardrobe. Okay, the first clothing item, how could I not start with a good old basic white tee? I feel like a basic white tee is an absolute essential in a capsule wardrobe for any season. This one from Topshop is a boxy weekend style tee with a slight turn up here on the sleeves. They are sewn in like that. And I love a turn up sleeve detail. I think it's a really flattering cut. Uh, this one is in a small to medium. I believe this one has been reduced. I bought this at full price at £10, but I think these are now in the sale at £8 and they have loads of different colours as well. A good basic tee like this with leather leggings is a go-to outfit for me with a blazer thrown over the top. So the next t-shirt that I wanted to show you is actually a longer line fit. So really nice to wear, again with leather leggings if you're wanting that longer style t-shirt to kind of cover your bum a little bit. But then you can equally half tuck it just to kind of give your figure a bit of shape. This one is actually from Top Man. And I've noticed on Topshop's website they have quite a few female models modeling Top Man. It literally says Top Man for Topshop. So worth noting, in fact, I have another item from a top man 
for Topshop. And this one is in a small, it's a beautiful stone color. It was only $11.99, so I thought that was a pretty good price point. Super boxy and oversized already, so no need to size up in this one. Like I said, a small for me works perfectly fine, and I am typically a UK size 10. The last of the t-shirts that I want to show you, because let's face it, a t-shirt is probably the most important essential piece in a capsule wardrobe. I have this, which is the Everyday Essential t-shirt from Topshop. When I bought these, again, ShopTag notified me that these had been reduced, so they were only £5 each. I picked up the white one in a UK 10, and this is definitely more of a fitted style. So if you're maybe wearing a bottom half that's a bit looser, maybe some straight leg trousers, sometimes it's quite nice to have a fitted top on top. So I got the white in a 10, and they didn't have any 10s left available in the black. So again, that's where you could use that shop tagger feature to be notified when a 10 comes back in stock. However, on this occasion, I just opted for a UK 12, which I think will work perfectly fine. Okay, the next essential item for me is a blazer. I absolutely love a blazer, especially an oversized single-breasted blazer. I have them in all varying natural shades, neutral shades. I do have two here to show you from Topshop, and you may recognize these from my recent Everything Five Pounds dot com haul if you are new to this channel then hello welcome my name is freya and i'm the biggest bargain hunter in the world and i actually spotted these two blazers which are originally from topshop this color in fact is still available online and it is priced on topshop at 59 pounds so i got this for the bargain price of five pounds this ivory color in particular is Stunning. It's got little tortoise shell button details on the sleeves and again single breasted. I also should have probably thrown in a black blazer. I don't actually have a black blazer from Topshop though and I don't know why but I was just kind of wanted to keep this brand consistent. I guess these shades though are perfect for that autumn season transitioning from the warmer months as you take the ivory through to the cooler months. This colour to me it's just autumn. But in terms of when I would wear a blazer as well, I like to style it up. So maybe if you're going out for dinner, heels and a nice outfit underneath, but also quite casually with just jeans, trainers, throw on a basic tee. And I like to throw the blazer over my shoulders as a nice additional layer. And as it gets particularly cold, I also like to layer hoodies under blazers too. And then moving on to three pairs of bottoms that I have to show you. I'm going to start with a pair of sand colored jeans. These are the Jamie jeans. The Jamie style is very high waisted, which is just an essential for me now. And these are also a skinnier fit. So usually I am more of a straight leg kind of wearer now, but I do like to have the option to pair with maybe oversized knit jumpers that come a bit longer maybe, or oversized tees that you can half tuck in. So I love the Jamie style, but not only do I love this style, I also love this color. It's a really nice neutral alternative to a blue or black. It's just that lighter option without having to go for a stark white, because I do actually think Think white jeans can be quite unflattering. You have to be careful when it comes to a white jean. And this really natural grayish kind of sand color is perfect for autumn. I wear these in a waist 28 leg 30. And I also managed to pick these ones up in the sale at 32 pounds reduced from 40, I believe. These are really great with the Zara bodysuits as well. Then with a blazer thrown over the top. So you've got a nice fitted outfit with a boxy oversized blazer. Throw on a pair of heels and you're good to go for an evening relaxed style outfit. For the next pair of jeans I wanted to show you, I did pick up from Topshop recently. They are straight leg, but I might actually send these back because although these are in a waist 30 leg 30, they seem to be cropped, which I didn't realize from the website that they were. So I do actually have my trusty all time favorite pair of straight blue wash jeans and they are from Primark. They are so amazing. They were about £13 when I bought them, but I think they've recently increased the prices of those jeans to 15 Still worth every penny. I love them. But I'll show you these ones nonetheless. They have a really nice single rip on the thigh. This particular style is priced at £42. And again, similar to the previous jeans, you could wear these styled with a nice simple Zara bodysuit underneath 
or a boxy oversized white tee with a blazer thrown over your shoulders. I know I sound like a broken record, but I really do like just wearing the key staple simple pieces time and time again. And that really is the beauty of a capsule wardrobe. So the next and final pair of bottom half items that I have to show you for autumn is probably my favorite. Over jeans any day, these are far more comfortable. I actually prefer the look of them as well to jeans. They are my ultimate staple. I'm gonna have to get my hands on a second backup pair this year because everybody went crazy for these last year. From Topshop, they're the high-waisted leather look leggings with like a fleecy kind of lining. The side zip as well, so there's no fuss and detail here, which can sometimes be a bit unflattering. You know, if you've got excess material, zips, buttons and everything like that. It can add a bit of bulk to your crotch area, which is not a good look. I just love everything about these. They're so high-waisted, so comfortable, elasticated at the top, so plenty of room for a food baby if you're planning on having a big meal out. And the fact that they're as thick as they are, I would be comfortable wearing something shorter, you know, if your bum is on show. Sometimes with a legging, you just feel like the need to have a longer line top or blazer to sort of cover your bum. But these are so thick and they're just amazing. They are £36 full price which again I think is a really good price point for such a staple capsule item within your wardrobe. Next up is something that I don't tend to wear as often, an oversized poplin shirt like this. I could have definitely given it an iron so I apologise for that. It's £35, I got it in a UK size 10. A really nice wide cuff with a double button, that kind of diplo hem where it's shorter at the front allowing an easier half tuck. I also quite like to layer shirts as it gets even colder with a nice knit jumper over the top with the collar sleeve and the bottom kind of popping out or sometimes I even think strip it back to wearing just a plain shirt open slightly and half tucked into a pair of straight leg blue wash jean I just think it's a really nice look but I probably will wear this most with the leather leggings so I did pick up two knit wear pieces the first one being a jumper like a long line jumper this is in an extra small. This was a sale find as well. This was the bargain price of just 20 pounds because this is with cashmere as well. I don't know how they can price a jumper with cashmere at 20 pounds, but they did and I love it. But again, paired with the leather leggings, I think this can make for a really nice look. In fact, it's one that I wore quite a lot last autumn. Just because I love the kind of dressed up vibe of the leather pant with a nice cozy jumper that just, oh, Makes me feel all cozy for autumn, which is my favorite time of the year. If you can't already tell from this video, I absolutely love a good chunky knit jumper. In addition to a jumper, I did pick up a chunky knit cardigan. Now I did oversize and size up to an extra large in this one because that's exactly how I want it to fit. On me, personally, I wanted an oversized fit so that I can like roll up the sleeves and really get that chunky, knit, cozy, comfortable outfit that I would probably wear more often than not around the house, but also if you're just nipping out anywhere. It's an outfit that looks really nice and well put together with uh, jeans or leather leggings. It was 29 pounds. I think they had a more camel color version as well. I did personally decide to go for the cream just because I think it's a little more wearable than a darker camel color. This next one was the other item that I saw top man on top shop and it is a good old basic sweatshirt. I did go for it in this white. I got it in a medium. Medium. It was only $19.99, which again, I think is a pretty good price point for a good basic sweater. I love the kind of oversized fit of wearing a men's sweatshirt. It's fleecy lined as well, so it's really nice and soft. With all of these items, the sand jeans, the blue, and the leather leggings, this is exactly what I would wear with those on a more casual, everyday basis. And I love to layer up with a crew neck some gold jewellery, like the one that I'm wearing today. These are from... Anna Luisa, in case you're interested. I'll leave a link to these below as well, actually, because I get quite a lot of questions on these. So yeah, love this. Can't go wrong with a basic sweatshirt. You can if it's white and you wear fake tan, but we'll move on from that. The last two items that I have are jacket slash lightweight coats, because I'm, I think what I'm gonna do is another winter capsule wardrobe with some more outerwear included in a month or two, maybe in November. Let me know if you'd be interested in seeing that. But for now, I've picked up two. This one is new in from Topshop. It is a beautiful utility style jacket with no hardware, 
But this pocket detail, the four pocket detail on the tie waist is lovely. I love the kind of light grey stone colour to this as well. So this one was £59. I got it in a UK 10. I thought this would look amazing with the tight leather leggings with some heels for drinks but also maybe even just for like you know if you want to look nice shopping out in town you've got a nice lightweight jacket because it can get quite hot when you're shopping in autumn when you're going in and out of the cold and then into the hot stores so to have a nice lightweight jacket alternative with the leather leggings and maybe some mid-heel boots. Boots again are another essential during autumn and winter. So I just love this. I had to share it with you guys with it being new in. It's just beautiful. I absolutely love it. I feel like we're going to see a lot of people on Instagram style up this jacket because it is beautiful. And last but not least, I have this lipped collared trench and i want to say trench but it's not the standard trench with the sort of double breasted buttons or anything again like the previous one it's minimal and simple in design with just a simple tie waist in the same fabric as the coat itself this big dramatic collar the lipped shoulder here is a trend that we saw quite a lot last year and one that I am a big fan of. I just think it adds that little extra detail to what is otherwise a pretty basic piece. I love this colour. I feel like it's a really nice neutral shade that would suit any skin tone. I got this in a UK 10 last year. It is still available on Topshop's website. So again, I will leave this linked below. This is a really nice lightweight coat again for those transitional months where it's not quite winter and cold where you just have to throw on a massive faux fur coat or something so chunky just because it's so cold. This is that really nice, in fact, this is why autumn layering is probably my favorite kind of season to style up outfits, just because you can actually see the outfit and nice lightweight layering allows you to be warm enough. But also if the sun does come out, you can take it off and you've got a nice t-shirt and leather leggings outfit. This is the last item that completes my autumn capsule wardrobe for this year. These are 15 key items that you'll be seeing a lot over on my Instagram. Thank you once again for kindly watching today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Do let me know if you want more styling videos like this in the future. And I hope to see you all very soon in my next video. Bye guys.